Hello and welcome to today's episode of the TTO Radio Show. Total takeover marketing explosion happening in 2015 on this planet. Today we're talking about the 90-day plan. Carl has been so gracious to put together a comprehensive 90-day plan. And then there's other panelists here, leaders in our industry, who have different aspects having to do with elements of the 90-day plan that we're going to reveal to you today. So it's going to be an awesome show. You're going to want to take out a pen and paper. You're going to want to take notes. Um, you can call in. I encourage you to call into the show. And the way you do that is um, dial 712-775-7035. And the PIN number is 213-884-POUND. Uh, you'll press star 6 in order to uh, raise your hand and comment or ask questions. Sorry, I had to multitask there. So here we go. Let's, uh, Carl uh, was, was a little bit, uh, had a little scratchy throat yesterday, and uh, we, we gave him copious amounts of, uh, of uh, Tylenol and, and uh other types of flu medications and uh, sinus medications, and got him all, got him all slicked up and ready for the show today. So, Carl, let's uh, let's talk about your 90-day plan, brother. Great, uh, thanks, Andrew. Uh, you know, before we get started, I just want to um, talk about a few things. We're going to have different panelists coming on talking about different aspects, as uh, Andrew mentioned, and uh, we want to make sure that. Um, uh, you know, you, you want to make sure you have a, a pen and paper ready. Uh, you know, we're going to give you a site where you can go to. Some of you may have the site, some of you may not have the site. But um, we want you also to be taking notes because, you know, we're at a critical point here um, with Total Takeover. Um, we're three days until uh, the official pre-launch where everybody uh, will not then have to start um, paying for the program to receive all the products not in the back office. And um, really, with the momentum we've had, especially yesterday, was a, a phenomenal day. Um, you know, there was, I don't know, I think it was close to 14,000 new people came in yesterday alone, which was quite amazing. Um, you know, here we're at, um, I don't know, somewhere around 82,000 people now in 18 days, okay? Uh, most companies would dream about having that in their one year. Um, and, you know, we've done that in 18 days. And... Uh, you know, starting on Monday, we'll have the uh, the pre-launch week, which we have from Monday to Friday, where everybody can get themselves activated. We expect to triple in size at that point. So, you know, this is why the 90-day plan to get this in place is very, very crucial. And, um, you, you know, I've, I've given this out to, to my team. I've given this out to the people in Total Takeover because it's a completely generic system. There's nothing any specific to any group or person or anything like that. It's just a process, a process that I've used for years that I've used to, to share with my team to help them grow. Um, and, um, you know, there, there's there have been testimonials from, from lots of groups that have used it, how, how it's helped them with their, their growth. And this is what it's all about. We're here to help everybody in Total Takeover to, to get their groups, to get their income, and to get their lifestyle to where they want it to be. So um, the first thing we're going to talk about today, uh, I'm going to do some, some screen sharing and show everybody what's going on. But we're gonna, I'm going to share with you a little bit about how important it is to do um, consistent posting on social media. Um, you know, we're going to uh, talk a little bit about um, solo ads um, and list building. We're going to talk a little bit about blogging. Okay, and we're going to talk a little bit about the old-fashioned on-the-phone stuff, okay? So there's going to be a little bit of aspects for everybody. You know, some of you may not be comfortable talking on the phone, but you'll have all the confidence in the world of doing uh, social media or uh, list building of some sort or um, solo ads or blogging, whatever it is. So we're going to be covering as much as that we can today. Uh, this will probably get carried over the course of a few days, okay? Uh, the whole idea of these Hangouts is to provide you with the absolute best information and training we possibly can to help you build your business, okay? So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to take over for probably about 15 minutes on here to go through some of the stuff, and then we're going to go across the panel and have the panel share with you the, the other aspects such as the blogging, the list building, uh, um, solo ads, and, and phone conversation, and, and so forth, okay? So, 
first of all, I guess what I need to do is I'm going to start sharing my uh, my screen here. So just give me a sec to do that. Uh, okay, let me know if you can all see my screen. Okay, uh, someone on the panel can just mention, uh, just unmute and let me know. Uh, I can see your screen. If you okay. are a panelist and uh, you do not see Carl's screen, you may have to go down and click on the little app down at the very bottom of our our screen for you to see it. But everybody out uh, watching this on Google Hangout and YouTube should be seeing your screen right now. Yeah, I see it, Carl. Okay, great. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to take you through a couple of things on social media. We're going to do Facebook, we're going to do LinkedIn, and uh, I'm going to do a bit of Google Plot too, okay? Um, Facebook, a lot of people, the majority of people are on Facebook, okay? Let's face it, it's the most popular social media online today. More popular than Twitter, more popular than LinkedIn and Google Plus and Pinterest and all that. It is the number one place that people hang out. So, how do you go about connecting with people on Facebook, okay? So, there's a couple of techniques that I learned from people over the past year or so that, um, that I do and works very, very well. Okay, first of all, the search option. You have the search bar that's up top here, okay? So the thing you want to do is, and hopefully Facebook has not changed their algorithm, okay? So the first thing you want to do is type who, uh, and I'm going to put Edmonton where I live, okay? Edmonton, Alberta. my friends okay and it looks like Facebook might have changed their algorithm again I'm not sure yes they did okay they keep doing that to keep people like me from doing what I like to do okay so let's try people who live in Edmonton no nope, they've taken that away too Wow, I may not be able to show this until I can figure out how this goes. Um, people who like uh, who like okay, let's put affiliate. Oh, okay. You know what? We're we're gonna have to we're gonna have to wait on this one here. They changed their algorithm. Those guys, son of a gun. Yeah, the workaround okay. on that, Carl, would be to uh, until we figure out uh, the back door for that, we have to uh, go and search for different groups. So you can do the same kind of search and find groups and join groups. Well, you can do groups. You can do groups. Okay, let's do that. Okay, um, we'll do we'll do a group search. I don't use groups too much. I use groups a different way. Okay, so let's go. Um, Let's go. Uh, oops, let me. Affiliate. Okay, I like to do affiliate marketing because it's like direct sales affiliate marketing. So here's a group right here. Okay, so we're going to bring up that group. I'm not actually going to join the group. Okay, right at this point, moment, I'm not going to actually join the group. This is what I do. I don't post in groups because posting in groups is almost um, just not even worth the time because nobody actually reads the posts okay I do something a little bit different what I do is I scroll down and I look for the people that are in here and what they're doing okay so you, you can see that these people here are doing some affiliate marketing I want to kind of see what it is they're doing and a lot of times what I'll do is I'll do I'll, I'll make a little post okay um, so I'll go and I'll like it, and it's not allowing me to comment. So normally you can actually comment on it, okay? So here's another one, uh, paid to click, okay? So, oh, you know what? I guess you have to be part of the group to do that. Okay, uh, I'll join the group. They've changed everything. 
You know, this is something we always run into because everything that yeah, we, you know, we always have to say on the changing crazy. So they're they you know what they're trying to get away from guys like me and others that are trying to work around the system. So uh, now it's pending there, so I have to wait. So I can't even do that because uh, I I'm not really a member of any groups. I don't think maybe I am. Let me just check. Uh, okay, here's one here. I think I'm a member of one group here. I used to be a member of like 500 groups, and I just I, I left all the groups. Okay, okay. So here's here's an example. See, we can comment in here. Okay. So what I'll do is Inez. Okay. So I'll go like, and I'll go. Okay. Okay. I found the workaround. Let me finish. Let me finish. How are you? And, and that's that's what I'm going to leave it at, okay? Now, what I'm also going to do is I'm going to look at what the program is, okay? You always want to make sure that if you're going to make a comment on somebody's thing, you better know um, what it is you're making a comment on, okay? Otherwise, you're, you're kind of misleading people. And I always like to see what this is because if they come back and they, they question me on it, okay, I want to be able to give some kind of uh, response to it, okay? So it's a mobile service, energy service type thing, okay? So obviously there's a, there's a video you can watch here, and you'll probably want to, um, you know, if it's a short little video, watch the video. Um, you know, get a little bit of information so you know what's going on. And if you're going to do this to a lot of people in there, make sure you make a list and you make comments on everything is. So when these people get back to you, you know what it is, okay? Otherwise, they know that you're just searching for other reasons. And then, you know what? We are doing that. We're looking to find people who are um, building a business who are interested in making money online, not just posting stuff. Because, you know, there's a difference between people who just go in and post in groups and then other people who are actually focused on the business they're posting. Okay? So there's a, there's a big thing behind that. And this is what I do. I don't post in the group. I actually go and make posts on other people's posts in there, and I get them to engage with me in conversation. And a lot of times I will get them on just onto Skype and then I'll have a conversation with them on Skype. Okay. Now remember, um, when you're doing this process, this is not where you get them on the phone and you pitch them your business. Okay. This is this is the relationship building part that you've got to that you gotta do with um, with social media. Okay. If you start pitching your stuff right away, okay, like giving links, okay. Uh, I'm going to show you a different tactic that I use people to engage with me. But don't be engaging with your links right away. You, and when you're doing this process, you want to find out how they're doing. Ask the questions. How long have you been in the business? How is it going for you? You know, are you are you creating a team? Like, is your is your team building those sort of things? You want to see where this person's at. You know, are they just joining a hundred thousand programs and hoping that something happens out of one of them, or are they actually focusing? And trying to actually build a business. Okay, I hope that makes sense. So <clears throat> that's that's one aspect of Facebook. Some of it we're going to have to go back and address, obviously, later. Now, Andrew, you wanted to comment on something? Yeah, instantly, whenever uh, you notice that uh, Facebook has changed their algorithm, which they have, and these things happen, um, I started looking for a workaround, and I'm. Uh, I, I have found a I found a workaround. So what you do, let me uh, let me go back to do exactly the same thing that you were showing. There's a there's a little bit different way to do it, and I just figured it out. Uh, let me go back to my home so I I can share my screen. You want to share your screen, or do you yeah, just want to tell me? One moment, I'll share my screen. Okay. So here we go. Okay. So, folks, you're getting a lot of, of value here today. You know, we're going to be going through this, and, and Andrew's now going to share his screen. And, um, you know, this this way here, this this is the kind of training we want to get everybody into, okay? This is what you're asking for. This is what we're going to do. Okay, so we got we got Andrew now. Go over to you, bud. Okay. Can everybody see my screen? Yes. Okay. Now, you were going to search uh, people who live in Alberta, uh, uh, Alberta who... Are not my friends. Okay, so here's the new way to do that. People 
to live in Austin, Texas, but don't put who are not my friend. And then you don't worry about the drop down. Okay, just just do the search. Whenever you do the search, you're going to see uh, it's going to come up on post, and everybody here in these posts are people that you're friends with. And don't worry about that. But this next tab right here, if you click people, it will show. Whoops. Um, okay. Uh, I did that with uh, people who work at network marketing, and whenever I click people, it came up with lots of people. So let me try a different search. And then I hit the search. Okay, now here's here's this search is yielding results, and if I and these are people that are are on my friends list that these where these posts are. You can see this is the post tab. All right, everybody, cross your fingers. Click people, and it should bring up people who work in network marketing and the opportunity to add them as a friend or message them right there. Okay. Okay, so that's good. Leave that up there, actually, Andrew. Okay, just if you can. Um, you know, this is this is this is great. So, what you want to do here, everyone, is you know you don't ever want to add anybody as a friend. Okay, very very important. Never add anyone as a friend on Facebook. Okay, you message them. Okay, so Andrew, if you could just click on the message tab for the first person up there, just as an example. Sure. Okay, sure. I'll click on. Your message okay so what we're gonna do is we're just gonna put a brief little message in here um, and um, I'll just uh, bring up my um, um, what it is here hang on okay we're gonna put something like very simple if you could just type this in Andrew so everybody can see this okay hey we don't know each other okay but I found you on Facebook it seems you do online marketing, correct? Okay, so um, just curious, has anyone talked to you about Total Takeover? Okay. Everybody okay see what that's simple. That's that's all you do. Okay. You just you, that's all you're doing. Okay. You're not giving any links. You're not giving any information. You're just ask. That's it. Okay. And what you do, and you got to be very careful in Facebook that you don't do this to too many people. So I would recommend 15 to 20 a day, not a half a day, not an hour a day. This keeps the flags away. Okay. Because Carl, the last thing you want to do is be put into that famous Facebook jail where hundreds of thousands of people are sitting there playing cards, right? Because uh, they're not able to do anything else in their business. So they're just sitting there playing board games behind bars in Facebook. So you want to stay away from that and, um, and allow yourself to uh, still engage with people. So that's what we're going to cover for right now, okay? So um, thanks, Andrew, Carl, for sharing that. I, I want to exp expand on that, Carl. Oh, I just, sure. just, I just sent that message to Darlene. Okay, and can everybody see my screen? As soon as I sent that message, I'm now clicked onto her profile. Can everybody see that? Okay. Well, yep. on her profile, what I'm going to do now. Now, I'm not an expert on this. This is just something I've learned, and I'm still learning to do what we're what Carl is teaching in the 90 day plan my my expertise is teaching you how to make a 50,000 pound phone light as a feather and how to get 15 to 25 people a day saying yes that requires some investment so we're to cover that later um, but but this is something that I've learned now I'm on Darlene's uh, profile and timeline and I've just sent her a message and we're not friends yet you see and I'm not going to click to add her as a friend either but what I am going to do is I'm going to go over and I'm going to find out where she lives and I'm going to click and hover over that that place where she lives and I'm going to go over and hit the like button 
Okay, so whenever I like that she lives in Portland, she's going to get that notification that I like where she lives. Okay, now I'm going to go and I'm going to click on to her photos. Okay, and uh, in her albums, I'm going to pick out that is uh, that that would be good for me to professionally look through. Now here I see football here. Okay, videos. So I'm going to click on the video album, and that one right there about football. I'm going to click on the video to like a, to watch it. I might watch it. I might not. Okay, because I have a son in football, and I'm going to click like on that. All right. Now she's going to get a notification that I'm looking through. She's going to see that I'm drilling through and I'm looking and I'm identifying with her and different things that she likes, and and I'm liking those things. I'm going to click through an album. I'm not going to go and I'm a male. She's a female. I'm not going to click on any images of her by herself and like them. However, I will go into her profile pictures and see if she happens to be married, if there is a, a photo of her and her husband. If there's not a photo of her and her husband, then I won't click on any of those photos. I also won't click on any photos of young children. Okay, But there's a dog. I have a Pomeranian dog. and So I'm going to go over here and I'm going to click that photo of that Pomeranian. Now, what I've done, what I've just done, just in a matter of a few clicks, without having had a one-on-one -on -one conversation with her, is I've done what Earl Nightingale, Earl Nightingale, yeah, d says, not a, <laughs> uh, Dale Carnegie says in the book that uh, that uh, uh, Joyce or Joan told us about yesterday, how to win friends and influence people. I am connecting with her on her favorite subject. She just got those notifications that I like that dog, I like the football game video and I liked where she lives. Now, I'm going to do one other thing. I'm going to go back to her timeline, and I may should have done this first, okay? Going through the timeline and reading some of the things she says, because she might be there using uh, uh, copious amounts of profane language, and I don't want to be around somebody that does that. So, you know, other people may, so if that's okay with you, that's fine. But drill through, and if there's anything that she's posting, that, that does not resonate or that, that is anti-resonant to me, then then I'll, I won't do all these other things. So I, I failed that step. So, you know, need to need to do that first. Um, so anyway, I'm going to look through and see if there's anything that she's posting that, uh, that I can like. There we go. There is a uh, photo on a comment that I like. Okay, I can like that. She's going to get that notification. And one or two other things. Um, promise to my children. Yes, I'm going to like that. Okay, so I'm going to go over here and I'm going to like that. Now I'm done. And then I'm going to go back to my search. So that's basically it. And then she's going to contact me. Awesome, Andrew. Thanks for adding that in. That, that's real important, too. And, uh, you know, um, if any of you are sitting here thinking, oh, that's a lot of work, well, let me tell you, uh, this business requires work, any business. That's why the, the, the successful people online today make the money they do, because they take the time to do the things that they do. Now, you know, what we just showed you here on going into that profile, making the little message to them, going through what Andrew showed you about liking and commenting and stuff, per, per, that's about five minutes, okay, per person. So, you know, you can do six to ten people uh, within an hour to do that on social media. Again, you know, it, it all depends on what you want in life, how much you're willing to, to put into everything. Um, the, in your business, you know, if if you don't want to put more than an hour a day into your business, well, then you got to figure out um, what you need to do to make that happen. If you're not making any money on the internet and only putting an hour in a day, then you got to start figuring out if an hour a day is is worth it to you uh, to even be in this business. Okay, um, all we can do as panelists and leaders here is we can only provide you with what we do. I'm a full-time marketer. This is what I do for a living. Okay, I put in my days just like everybody else does. But you know, 
Um, I, I can put in an eight-hour day, work five, six days a week, and eight hours a day, you know, 40, 48 hours a week. But for the average Joe doing that, maybe they're making twenty-four to thirty thousand. But me, I could I could build a fifty to a hundred thousand dollar paycheck doing that. So is forty to forty-eight hours a week worth it? Hell yeah. Okay. Um, I don't I don't always work an eight-hour day. Um, you know, for me to do what I'm going to teach you here in the ninety-day plan can be done within an hour to three hours a day. Okay. But you've got to be consistent about it. You've got to be consecutive about it every single time. Um, I spend most of my time um, supporting and helping my team. Okay, The first few hours of the day are mine for me to do my marketing, whatever I need to do to connect to people. And the rest of the day, I'm helping my people connect to people, doing through things like I'm sharing here on the Hangout, like what I shared and Andrew shared Okay, on the Facebook. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to take you over to LinkedIn to show you on LinkedIn just how easy it is to, to connect with 50 to 100 people a day there. And I, it takes me about an hour to do that a day, okay? No, no word of a lie. takes me um, that much time, and that's it. So here's what I do. Here's your LinkedIn account, okay? Um, I actually went through this morning and did some already, but I'm going to do some more here live with you. You go to where it says Connections, Keep in Touch, okay? This is going to bring up um, a, uh, uh, a list of all the people that you can connect with. Can you guys see my screen, first of all? Everybody can see my screen, right? Hello? Someone on the panel answer? Yes. Yes, we can see it. Okay, Everybody, good, everybody was nodding their head, yes. Okay, yeah, I, I don't see you because I'm looking at the screen. I don't, I don't see the hangout. Okay, so here's what I'm going to do. You're going to see a bunch of connections that are going to come up. Some are going to say, say congrats. Some are going to say happy birthday uh, and so forth. And then you're going to get down to the connects. The happy birthdays are always first, okay? So here I'm going to show you how to connect with that, okay? And this is how easy that it is, okay? Now, for anybody that is having a birthday, okay? So we're going to look at the birthdays first. I respond to everybody who's having a birthday, okay? So it'll always come up, happy birthday, whoever it is, and your name. I erase that. I put in my signature, and at the end, I'll put in my link, okay, that goes on here. And I'm not going to put my link in here now because I don't want anybody seeing that, okay? But I'll normally put my link in in here. So whatever your link to your total takeover is here or whatever business you're doing, Okay, you, you put in right after your Facebook. But make sure you engage them with your Skype and your Facebook. Okay, if you're not on those two things, you better be on those two things because that's where the money is. Okay, so I'll just send that off. So now I've just said happy birthday to Mark. Okay, and um, I've uh, given him my information. He would normally have my link at this point. Congratulations. This is another one. I look to see what they're in. He's an uh, inventor at this place here. So you know what? I'm going to congratulate this guy. But I'm also going to like what he's doing. I always like everything when I'm saying congrats to somebody. Okay? And again, I put in my, my information. Okay? It's got my Skype. It's got my Facebook and everything on there. I usually have my link. Okay? But I'm not doing that for this case. Now, I will go and I will comment. Now, there's two different ways to do this. This person I just commented to, okay, I said congrats to, was not a network marketer. He was in something else. So there's a different way of engagement for people who are network marketers and who aren't network marketers. That person was not a network marketer because he was an inventor, okay, something totally different. But inventors also like money. Uh, everybody likes money. I don't think there's anybody who doesn't like money. It's just a matter of how you engage with them, okay? So Henry has a new job here. I help others quit their jobs and I work from home. So this guy is an online marketer, okay? So I'm going to go and I'm going to congrats him. This is the other way that I engage people. Again, I like them, okay, and then I congratulate them. But, okay, I'm going to post that in here, but I'm also going to add something else, okay? And I don't know if you all know what that is, but here is what it is. By the way, has anyone talked to you about Total Takeover yet? Okay, comment. That's it. No links, no nothing. You're asking them to engage with you, okay? Let them come back and then start the engagement. 
The problem that most people have is they are so quick to give their links out that they actually kill any possible sale before it even has a chance to happen. Okay? So, any questions or comments on what I've just shown you here? Uh, I have a comment. Uh, did, did everybody notice that whenever he started to type that comment, he disappeared for a little bit, came back, and pop, there it was? It's because he has a copy and paste file that has canned questions and canned responses, and that saves a lot of time. Yeah, a ton of time, a ton of time. And, I, and I'm actually going to provide all this to anybody who wants it, okay? Um, all these little things that I put in here, um, I'll provide that. I actually have it on my... 90-day um, plan site, so you'll be able to go to the site and, and get everything from there, okay? So basically what you're going to do is you're going to go through all these people. You're going to say happy birthday to all these people. You're going to congrats all these people, and then after you've done all that, then all of a sudden all of these will go away, and then you'll see connect, and this is where you get to connect with people, okay? Now, on the connection, it's the same thing like I just posted. You know, um, you know, let's connect on Skype as well, this type of thing, right? Has anyone talked to you on Total Takeover? Um, and then your, your name. You don't have to write any of this extra stuff I have in here. But it's, it's strictly a three-line that you go in. I'd like to connect with you, find out what you're all about. Uh, by the way, has anybody talked to you about Total Takeover? And your signature. That's it, okay? These people will respond. This thing you see up here... Okay, this thing lights up for me every single day. I'll have anywhere from 10 to 100 in my email waiting of responses because I do this with 50 to 100 people a day on LinkedIn. You know, my LinkedIn connection account is somewhere around seven or 8,000 now, right? And, and it's growing by 100 a day. So this is something you need to do. Again, this will take about, I don't know, let me say an hour. Okay, so you've got an hour on Facebook, an hour on LinkedIn, and um, Google Plus is a little bit different, okay? With Google Plus, I, can't, I actually can't share on here because I'm actually in the company Google account, so I can't actually do that or into the, uh, the uh, Total Takeover Hangout account. So I can't actually do it on there um, for personal stuff. But um, I'll, do, I'll do the Google Hangout a little bit, or the Google um, engagement uh, on another session when I'm not in that account. Okay, um, but it's the same thing. You're going to go in, you're going to connect to people just like you do on LinkedIn. Same thing. You don't engage, you do not give links, you ask questions. Okay, the simple question is, has anybody talked to you about Total Takeover yet? That's it. They're either going to respond back and they're going to say, yeah, I've already heard about it, not interested. Okay, great, thanks. And you respond back to them, hey, thanks for responding, I appreciate that. Let's keep in contact. And that's that and you move on to the next one. Don't get upset because they said no to you because you're going to get a lot of people are going to say no to you because they don't even know what they're doing online. Okay? Some of them might be very, very focused on what they're doing online and, and really don't have time for Total Takeover or anything else. That's fine too. Respect that. Okay? So there's, there's a lot of different things. You're going to go through this engagement every day. I've had people come back to me months later and join me because they saved my email. Or they, they were watching me on social media and saw how consistent I was and go, you know what, I see how consistent you are, I want to work with you. Okay? This is real, real important. Now, one other thing I want to go to, I'm going to actually bring up um, the, um, the, oops, I'm going to bring up the, uh, uh, my 90-day plans here. Um, Okay. Wait for it. Wait for Hang it. On. Is it coming up? Did I type it in right? Dun, dun, dun. Holy crap. Hey, hang on. I don't know why it's not coming up. Give me a second. PTO, not a banner. Oh, action plan. See, I typed it in wrong. See? My bad. 
Okay, here we go. This is the total takeover action plan that I have on here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take you through um, making posts on social media, okay? And then I'm going to get this over to the others because I think I'm taking too much time here. Um, actually, you know what? I think I'm going to I'm going to cut it down here because this may take me another 10-15 minutes, and I want to make sure the rest of the panelists have time, okay? So uh, we'll continue this next week. I'll do this this version next week. Let's get over to the rest of the panel, okay? So I just want to uh, um, let's. Um, Al, uh, 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 what's your name? Andrew. Andrew, let's go over and uh, to you, and then uh, let's bring on, um, uh, I don't know, uh, Joan or Janet, whoever you want to bring on. Um, uh, Lorraine, we'll, uh, we'll get to you a little bit. Uh, I wasn't sure what you had to offer. You came on a little bit late on the Hangout, so um, we don't know what kind of training um, that you can actually offer here. So let's go Let's go to uh, back to you, Andrew. And uh, Thank you, Carl, and everybody. Everybody, uh, join with me, and and let's uh, give Carl a hand. He did a great job there. That was a, a great deal, and I can't, I can hardly wait for the follow up that you have there on the 90 day plan portion because, uh, you know, I reached out to you to uh, to get involved with the exact methods that you're using, um, uh, removing myself basically uh, within your training as if I don't know anything. So. Uh, uh, so that uh, I can implement what you're training a brand new newbie and I got I must say it is about developing a habit and it is not easy it is simple but it's not easy and I'm having to add little parts for instance I started my 90 day plan habits of doing the good morning post uh, before all the rest of them, so I had to do that and then work at the rest of them, and then and then I'm at a, a couple of days at it now. So you know, within a couple of days now, I have been able to manage being persistent and consistent with making certain posts at certain time slots, not exact times, but certain time slots during the day, uh, including encouragement and. Uh, uh, invitations to this show, invitations to the webinar at night. So, folks, this this stuff works for whatever business you're in. It doesn't. You, you don't have to be involved with us in this company for this stuff to work. So, if you're watching, um, and we're always talking about our company, don't worry about that. If if you have a primary business and and uh, you want to use this stuff to build your business, that's perfectly fine. Um, let's go over. Oh, wait a minute. We have callers. We have uh, quite a few callers, and I want to encourage you if you're calling in on the phone line. Uh, to raise your hand and make a comment or ask a question. The way you do that is simply press star six and follow the prompt. That'll put you into queue. Um, I do have a Skype uh, connection as well, but I do not think that they're trying to call in to the radio show because they just tried to add me instead of following directions and messaging me first. If you're if you live outside or if you do not have a telephone to call the the, the call-in number you can Skype in the way you do that is text me on Skype at TTO radio TTO radio member name on Skype is our studio and text me first please do not call me text me and let me know your intention that you would like to be a caller and then I will call you because I can only take one Skype caller at a time okay uh, Tracy just joined us as well. Uh, Tracy, welcome back. I saw you were on a while ago. Uh, let's go over now to Janet. Are you ready? I am now. <laughs> got to click that unmute button. Hi, everybody. I, that, the, I got to tell you guys that uh, anybody watching in on this or watching the replays, if they're not learning tips to build their business, they're not paying attention. Uh, I get people tell me all the time how hard this is and, and it's confusing and, and there's just too much to do and I can't figure it all out and I'm overwhelmed and it, I'm thinking, it, I don't get it. I don't get it at all. There's such simple strategies, you can just grab one of them and do it. Now I think that the challenge here is that you're all trying to do everything. You're all trying to learn how to build your list and learn how to create lead capture pages and you're trying to learn how to do social marketing and you're trying to learn to use safe lists and you're trying to learn to use traffic exchanges and you're trying to learn to do this and you're trying to learn to do that and you're not doing any of it because you're still trying to learn it. 
And I'm going to recommend to all of you that you just slow down a bit and pick one strategy off the list. Carl's got a 90-day plan uh, for our team. If you're on our team, we have a blog that includes Carl's 90-day plan along with a few other strategies. I'm a list builder. I teach people how to build their list, how to get people on their autoresponder. Because to me, once you're on my autoresponder, that's gold. I can follow up with you every day. I can get your information. I can call you. I've, I've got everything there. I don't lose you. Now, social marketing, you got two whammies there. You get them on your contact list. That's just like having a someone on your list. However, what your ultimate objective, even from your social networks, is get them on your autoresponder. Get people on to subscribe to what you're doing. That That's really the ultimate goal, is getting connected with people. But pick one of these strategies. I have started doing the LinkedIn strategy that Carl taught. Of course, I janitized it because that's what I do. Took it and just tweaked it a little bit, uh, changed it a little bit so that I'm uh, doing what I, what I do and, and what I teach. But I followed his strategy and it was easy. In fact, I actually had to sit and watch his video. I'm, I'm not a one to follow instructions much. I must go in there and do it. I watched the, the call, I remember. And I had to sit back and watch the video replay. And it took like five minutes. I went into LinkedIn. I did the strategy and I thought, this is too easy. Anybody who says they can't build their list or they don't have people to talk to or they don't know where to find leads, Aren't, aren't doing any of these strategies because that's one of the simplest ones out there on LinkedIn to go and connect with people to say happy birthday and, and ask that question. Has anyone talked to you about this? Whether it's LinkedIn or, or I mean whether you're saying have anyone talked to you about Total Takeover? Has anyone talked to you about XYZ Company? Has anyone talked to you about how to do this? Has anyone talked to you about that? Really, it's brilliant and uh, you know that's why we're working with this team because everybody here thinks outside the box but makes it simple. Now it's up to you not to complicate it and I'm really going to challenge you all to stop trying to do everything. Pick one of these strategies. Um, like Carl, I was actually talking on our call yesterday on our training call that just like you Carl, I spend about two maybe three hours in the morning doing my marketing. All right, so that's where I'm doing my safe list advertising and I'm getting my ads out there where they need to get. I'm getting on LinkedIn and I'm doing my connecting on LinkedIn and I'm getting on the other social networks. I have my daily routine that's a little bit different every day depending where I'm doing my marketing. But I'm spending two to three hours a day doing that. The rest of the day, just like you, following up with the team, answering their questions, helping direct them to do the things they need to do. And just like Carl, I try to keep it simple. Here you go. Here's the plan. Do this, do this, do this. You're going to make this happen. All of this is designed to help you build a list. I mean, I know that when Total Takeover launches on Monday, we're all going to be sitting here going, rah, yay. You know, I've been doing internet marketing for 15 years and I know that when this system is ready, when, when we have access to get that in our hands, our lists are going to explode out of the water because I know what these guys are capable of. And I know you've got all the training here to drive the traffic to those sites. Hello, this is a match made in heaven. So it's up to you to learn some of these strategies, learn how to put a link in your signature file to that lead capture page. And if you don't have, you know, if you're not using other lead capture pages, send them to your total takeover page somewhere where they're going to be getting on a list so that you can follow up with them forever until they decide to leave. That's been important to me from day one. I remember, just quick story here, the first network marketing business that Don and I got involved in back in, oh, forever ago, it was about eight years ago, uh, 76 I think it was, or 76, <laughs> 2006, goodness gracious, 2006 we got involved in our what I would call our first traditional network marketing company, very much an offline company, but guess who I am? I, I'm the online person, I'm the internet marketer and you know, we, we joined this company, I sent a letter to my list. And bing bada boom, all of a sudden we're going on an all expense paid trip and we've we've qualified for all these awards and we're getting paid all this money and we, we go on this trip six months after we joined. Okay, so we qualified right away, we're on this trip, everybody says, how long have you been with the company? Six months and they're in shock. They, they followed us everywhere we went because they wanted to know our secret. And do you want to know my secret? It was really easy. 
I'd spent six years, seven years before that building my list. I had a list of people who were following what I do, who were listening to the strategies, who, you know, we were all working together in other programs and when I came to them and said, here's where we're going to rest our hat, just like I did with Total Takeover, here's where I'm resting my hat, come and rest your hat with me, and they did. And that was my secret. I said, I spent seven years building my list. They followed me and it was that simple. So then they all wanted to know, how can I build a list overnight? <laughs> It's going to take you a while, okay? <laughs> it doesn't happen overnight. But follow the leaders here. Follow what we're teaching you. Pick a strategy. Master it. Learn how to do it really well and do it every single day. Don't give up. Don't stop. Don't let the phone interrupt you. Okay, a Andrew's going to teach you how to make this phone as light as feathers. Don't even worry about the phone right now. What I'm talking about is don't let the phone interrupt you when you're doing your marketing. Make it... Make it um, Oh, something that's important to you because if it's not important to you, you're not going to do it. You're going to let your mother and your aunt interrupt you because they need you right now. You know what? If you were working at a job, nobody would be phoning you and telling you they need you. So make that two or three hours a day important to you. Get rid of the interruptions. Do the activities you need to do. Get that list building so you can build relationships with people. Get in touch with people. Just do it, guys. The, the magic's going to happen on Monday. It's up to you if you take those actions every day so that you can take advantage of it. So, uh, Carl, thanks for everything you put together. Again, you make my job easy. I just take what you do and go, boop, there you go, guys, do it. <laughs> so, you guys are awesome. Thanks. That's it from me for today. Thank you, Janet. Wow, Tracy, I'm envious of you and your pen and paper because I know you took notes on what Janet just said, and I'm sitting here watching the, the, the different things in the studio, managing the studio, and I'm going to have to go back and study. Janet, thank you so much for that input. And uh, I want to mention about the list, and, and, and you spent time building a list, um, drawn from my mental notes. Um, I, I'm, I'm going to be talking here in a little bit uh, about those people that say, how can I get a list instantly? So I'm one of the people that need the instant list because the list that I built in the past, when my junk that I picked up, I, I got rid of that list. So <clears throat> I, I, I purchased lists. So I'll talk about that in a little bit. And how to uh, how to uh, be proficient with a uh, purchase list of contacts, not leads. So let's go over to. I'm going to talk about this. Um, um, search engine optimization is is something that is an element of blogging. And any time that you have a blog properly installed, or you use a blogging site, and you're good at writing content and telling stories and you do it persistently and consistently and put that new content on the blog, the spiders on the search engine are looking for new, fresh, and relevant content and will organically bring sites that have new, fresh, and relevant content to the top of the searches with different uh, search terms that are in that blog. So on that subject, I would like to bring our blogging person on. And Joan, will you tell us about what you do? Yes, I'm glad to. Blogging has always been something that I've loved because even when I was in school, I used to love to write essays on books I read. I was I loved literature. Um, I love composition. So that was something that came naturally to me. And I never was able to really program myself into something that I enjoy doing in the work field until I got into network marketing. And when I set up my own site, I started to blog, first of all, because I'm a natural health enthusiast, I would blog on the um, information that I would gather from the internet and other sources from books I read, etc., about the subject that I was dealing with. And I started blogging on my site. Then I got interested in um, coaching and training and then when I got involved in other companies I started to blog about the things that I was involved in and one of the things that I found in network marketing is that when you blog you're blogging and people are getting to know you they're getting to know how your mind works what's important to you the things that you enjoy discussing and communicating to other people and that starts to build a rapport 
Now, one of one company that I was in a few years ago, and I was very uh, got very intense in my blogging. I did really, really well, and I'm sure that blogging is something that if you like to write, if you like to communicate thoughts, if it's something that really interests you, you can do very, very well at blogging because like. Um, Andrew said if you're set up properly in your search engine optimization so people can find you and you use the proper keywords that people are going to be searching for, then you're not going to have to go out and search for people because they're going to come to you. And so I make sure that I have a place on my um, website where people can comment, they can contact me, um, and that gives me an opportunity to reach out to them. And when you're blogging, it's really important to make sure your content is correct. If you're using some content from other sources on the internet, make sure that you contact them to see if it's okay that you implement their content into your blog. This is something I never have to do very often because I usually am able to put together a blog without having to do much resourcing. But I feel that blogging is an excellent way to get people to know you. Now you take these blogs, you can I always put a video in front of my blog and explain a little bit about myself and what the content of the blog is going to be. After your blog is finished and you've um, put it online, you can put it in Facebook, Twitter, LinkedIn, Google, Pinterest, any net um, social networking com uh, social networking that you're working with, you can post your blogs on and on a regular basis. Don't blog and then quit blogging for a month and start up again. Just like reaching out on Facebook, LinkedIn, Twitter to build your list. You're building your list with your blog, so you want to have a presence every day on the internet with your blogging. And you can do that on a regular basis, and if you do, that's going to build credibility. Because just like on Facebook, your face is out there all the time, people get to know that you're credible, that you're going to be there for them, that you're, you're building something that's important to you, you want to do the same with your blogs. So it's a real great way to get exposure, to get people to know, like, and trust you. I think it's an excellent way to um, increase your your um, cash flow in your business to reaching out to people and bringing them in. It's it's an excellent way to really get known for what you do. Awesome, Joan. Thank you so much, and. Uh I look forward to um, the post. I've, I've watched your blog. You, you were doing some video blogging too, and um, yeah, that's uh, that's that's a new concept that's uh, been on the table for oh, a couple of years. Or so video blogging along with regular blogging. So you can do your do your video blogging and then transcript uh, what's what you said into the text part of the blog, and it makes a, a dynamic. Uh, uh, way for organic searches to find you, especially on YouTube. So you can doc, do YouTube videos and use YouTube as your blog platform. Do this transcript of what you say instead of having to write stuff. You can just say and then then transcribe it, and then that's your text and put that along with the video, and it goes to the top of search engines for the different terms that are in that. Um, okay, let's see, uh, Carl. Who else was going to bring some training today? Let's see. Well, I wonder if wonder if Tracy's here. Oh, there she is. Hi, Tracy. Hi, Andrew. Sorry, guys. I had to pop in a little bit. Wow, what a powerful hangout, you guys. Sorry I missed the first part. I will definitely watch this most likely over and over again. And I guess my role right now is just to reinforce and validate everything that you guys have brought to the table. What a powerful team. What a powerful uh, training session. Um, you know, I, I, Carl, I already know what value you have in your 90-day plan. I've, I've read through it. I've used it. I've shared it. Um, you know, anybody that, that is looking for at least the first steps and 
all their future steps, uh, definitely plug into that and, and adopt that. Uh, Janet Wise, very wise, um, I mean, in your, your history and your experience in this industry, I mean, I just want to reinforce a lot of the things that you had to say. And yes, I take notes. This is one of my tools that I use. Uh, and of course, my highlighter because uh, you know what? I am a note taker. And for me, um, I write things down. It's the way that my brain processes things. If I can write it down and read it, for some reason, it's that second step that it makes it into my brain and, and sticks. If I just listen, um, I'll listen to it. But if I write the, the pertinent notes down, I, for some reason, it just does stick in my mind. Um, but you know what? You have to crawl before you can walk, and you have to walk before you can run. And you know what? Maybe the people here have, have got a lot of experience, and I know they do. These people are veterans in the industry. But you know what? The common denominator in everybody was they got started. And you know what? Tomorrow will never come if you don't start today. I mean, it, it, tomorrow is always tomorrow. Uh, so you know, these everybody's laid out such a wonderful gift to everybody here about what they do personally and their training. Um, and you know what? It is all about effective communication. You know what? You really great advice, Janet. Uh, I, I was really, um, uh, really was taking notes through what you were saying there. Um, and again, we're in a really great time right now. Just referring specifically to Total Takeover. Um, you know, we have a whole weekend. People have built organizations in 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 a couple of days. What better opportune time do you have right now but to focus, truly focus, and building your organization, helping your team build their teams, and utilizing these tools right now? It is a force out there to be reckoned with right now. I've never seen anything like this in my in my years in this industry. And I don't think that anything like a phenomenon like this has ever happened. And I mean, just so that we're only just a few people, like 20 people away from our team uh, actually breaking 20,000 uh, pre registered members in this. So, I mean, phenomenon, absolute phenomenon, 20,000 people. I I'm just flabbergasted. But, you know, everybody brings, and, and Joan, what a wonderful, I love what you were saying. Great, great advice about blogging. And you know what? I think blogging for a lot of people. You're a great writer. I think it's a real, the really the personal touch that makes the difference. You're right. People want to get to know who you are, and I think blogging is a really a, a therapy session for a lot of people because you know you can put your personal, your personal uh, input into things, your opinions. You know, you maybe ca ca cause a little bit of controversy. <laughs> a little bit of controversy out there is good because you want people to engage. You want to know people. You want to let people know that you stand for something, you have an opinion about something, and you know what? That's awesome because people will engage with you and know that you're a real person. And uh, I mean, that's how people rise in the rankings is because it's engagement. So brilliant, brilliant work, uh, Joan. Really happy to hear that you bring that to the table too. Um, you know, so if you're a beginner, great. Every day forward, when you learn to do something, focus on one thing. Great advice, Janet. Focus on one thing and do it well. You know, if you get overwhelmed, block your. Here's where what happens. Turn off your Facebook. Turn off your phone. Put a sign on your door and block off an hour or two hours or whatever time you have available. Make it useful time. Don't waste your time because you know what? An hour can go by and you say, "Whew, that was that was a tough day." But all you did was play around on Farmville or or you know uh, you know look at a couple of, of funny videos on Facebook or whatever the case may be make it useful focused productive time and you will be amazed at where you can take your business in a very very short period of time support your team you're the team leader so support your team offer them the tools that you're using and show them and, and share your success because it is a success line. It's not an upline or a downline. We're all in this as a group together, as a team, you know. And and that's why we're putting on these hangouts. It's for you and it's for your benefit. Uh, we love getting together. We this is a this is a therapy session for all of us every day. Uh, we get a chance to come in and, and share our opinions and our views. We don't always agree. And you know what? It's great because this is why. Uh, it, it, it is so powerful. You know, we have the opportunity of you to call in, take part in this. This is for you guys. You know, whether it's on the telephone, whether it's on Skype, whether, whether you want to be part of the panel, this is all for you folks. And it doesn't matter if you are part of this particular organization, but you are part of the company. We don't care. We want you to take part in this. Bring your goods to the table. If you're a brand new beginner, come in and say, hey, look, at this is my this is my viewpoint. That's the most important because the most important person in this entire 
organization is the brand new person. And if we don't take care of that brand new person and show them the direction to go, help and assist as leaders, then we haven't done our job. So that's what we're doing here. And you know what I like to do, and, and I mean I'm my part of, of um, I love to do digital media. And did I learn it overnight? Hell no. It took me years. I mean I've been doing face or sorry, Photoshop. I don't even know how many years, 10 years maybe, I've been studying it and I study it with a passion because I love digital media, I love After Effects, I love doing the, the special effects in the videos and you'll see them pop up every now and again. I always post them on my Facebook page, generic, go take them. I'm, I'm happy that you go and share them. I don't put any links on them, it's there for the team, it's there for everybody to utilize. So if you find it, have that or it's yours to use. And I do that because I think about the needs of the many outweigh the needs of the few or the one. We're all in this here together to succeed together because if you succeed, then we succeed. And, uh, you know, I can't enforce that any, any more than I possibly can because it really is all about you. Uh, it has nothing to do with me. It's everything to do about you and not me. So, um, you know, I... I Hey, Andrew, back over to you, buddy. Do we have anybody phoning in? Thank you. Yes, we do have a lot of people phoning in. And again, we're doing our job correct because no one's wanting to ask questions. They're just listening. So if you'd like to comment or ask a question, press star six and raise your hand. Uh, we're at the top of the hour, and we can run over for a little while if we want to because, hey, we own our own business. And uh, there's no rule that says we have to shut it off at 1 uh, uh, or 2 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. We can run over. Um, I guess it's my turn to talk about uh, uh, for the people who want an instant list. There is a way to create to get an instant list, um, and, and we can talk about that now, or we can do it in another segment or whatever. What do y'all think? What do you think, Carl? Because I got to tell you, it's totally, it's totally up to you. I mean, you know, we're, we are on a roll. I mean, we can make this go uh, an hour and a half, or we can cut it off and continue on because we are going to do this a couple more times next week, like you know, part two, part three, because uh, there is a lot to cover in the 90-day plan that can't be done in one day. Okay, well, let me give a snippet then. Let's just let's just do a little snippet. Maybe there's somebody can do a role play with me. Um, and um, let me talk about the list first. If you do not already have a marketing list, you can do what I like to do. Now, this is something I like to do, and people in the industry will tell you that it does not work. And I'm here to tell you the reason that it does not work for them is because they don't know and have the experience that I know and have. And that is to be able to connect with somebody on the telephone on a list that has been purchased and be able to do it in a non-threatening way so that you can get 15 to 25 people per day to say yes to taking a look at your opportunity. Before I do that, I need to find out where this sound is coming from. It looks like maybe Joan. No, yeah, it, okay, it was Joan. All right, so, um, okay, let's talk about leads. Now, we, we have here in our free launch with Total Takeover, the opportunity for people to be involved in co-ops, which gets guaranteed registrations to your Total Takeover link. That list of people is one thing, okay? And it's not expensive to have uh, 100 guaranteed registrations. Now, those aren't people that have joined your business and they're paying and they're, that, that's contacts that have, that have registered and connecting with them and developing a relationship is still part of the process with those just as any, with anybody else. Uh, but they're, they're, they're leads and they are specific to Total Takeover because they have uh, in some way, form or fashion opted in to Total Lake Takeover through your um, um, affiliate link. Aside from that, what I like to do, and it doesn't matter what business I'm building, I like to purchase contact databases. So let's talk about the difference between leads and contact databases. A lot of people are burnt out on leads because they th believed the advertisement that said it was leads. I'm telling you, if you don't have your own data capture page and have done your own marketing and attracted people to your own data capture page, or a system that has your own data capture within their system and it's a fresh person saying look there's Carl, there's Tracy, there's Joan, there's Janet and there's what they have for me and I'm going to fill out this form because I want to talk with them about what I'm seeing on their contact 
page, their data capture page. Short of that, that's a lead. Short of that, what they're selling out there as leads are not leads. They're, con they're targeted contact databases at best. I like them because I know how to handle them. So the only contact databases that I purchase these days, I used to purchase any of them all over the world. These days I only purchase people in my own area code because whenever I pick up the phone and call somebody and if they see a, a an area code calling them outside of their own or a toll-free number or anything like that, they're not anywhere near as apt to pick up the phone in person and say hello as they are if it's from their own area code. So that's rule number one that I follow and that I teach. So I don't get opportunity seekers. Uh, I can, but I don't focus on that. There's plenty of people that are already in network marketing or have been for me to talk to in my own area code. So I acquire contact databases of networkers in my area code, and these are genealogy lists. Uh, I know there's going to be a tons of people message me and say, hey, where do I get these contacts, and, and what do you do? I am focused on T, uh, TTO radio right now and everything that we're doing here, so I'm really not doing that training right now, and, and give it, but I will here shortly in a few days or, or, or a couple of weeks. But to, to contact somebody in your own area code in the way that I do it is totally non threatening and it works and you can get 15 to 25 people a day to say yes so who would like to do a quick role play and I'll just show you how that sounds anybody yeah. I think sure, Tracy I does. Who, who's gonna do the role play I John, will. John okay John thank you John alright uh, first of all when I'm calling um, uh, you're you're picking up the phone because you see that it's coming from your own area code. Uh, I'm, what what town are you in, Joan? Kelowna. You're in where? Kelowna, British Columbia. Kelowna. Yes. Kelowna. Okay, British Columbia. All right. Can we do? Will you do me a favor and pretend that you're in San Marcos, Texas? Sure. Okay, Joan is going to pretend like she's in San Marcos, Texas, for me. And and so I'm going to ring the phone and she's going to answer and and I found her by purchasing her name on a list but she doesn't know that okay so I just told you that I didn't tell her that she doesn't know that so let's just do this ring ring hello Joan yes hi Joan this is Andrew Morgan giving you a quick call from my house in San Marcos how are you doing today I'm doing well thank you. Great, me too. Hey, listen, Joan, you and I don't know each other, and don't worry, I didn't call you to sell you anything or, or uh, give you a sales pitch or anything like that. I just wanted to ask you a quick question. Okay. My company is looking for people in our area, a thousand a week. Joan, my question is, is do you know anybody that would be interested in taking a look? Um, well, what is this about? Oh, what we do is real. That's a good question, John. What we do is what you've already been doing all your life. You just haven't been getting paid for it. Let me give you an example. Have you ever been to a movie or a restaurant that you liked and you told somebody else about it and they went and ate there or watched the movie? You ever done that, Joan? All the time. Yeah, yeah, we all have. Did you ever get paid for doing that, Joan? You got to be kidding. Absolutely not. I just want to share what I like with people. Right, right, right. Well, how would you like to get paid for doing exactly that? Now, how could I do that? You can do it very well. I've been doing it for a long time, and it works very well. Say, listen, you got a pen and paper handy? Uh, yes, I do. Look, I'm going to give you a free video. And, Joan, in this video, it's going to tell you everything about who we are, what we do, how to do it, how to get involved, and everything, so that you can make a educated decision. Can so, I ask you a question? Sure. Is this network marketing? Network marketing? Do you like network marketing? Um... Not really. Not really. Well, if you don't like network marketing, John, then we probably don't have anything in common. And and if I, we continued, I'd just be wasting your time. We'd be wasting each other's time. Yeah. Well, I'm not really interested. Okay. Have a great, great day. Bye for now. Click. Bye bye. People bubble. People bubble. People bubble. Beep. Ring ring. Hello. John. This yes. This is another John. This is a new John. John. Yes. Andrew Morgan giving you a quick call from my house in San Marcos. How are you doing today? Good, thank you.
Right. Hey, John, you and I don't know each other, and don't worry, I didn't call you to sell you anything, give you a sales pitch or anything like that. I just wanted to ask you a quick question. All right. <clears throat> my company is looking for help in our area, a thousand a week. My question, Joan, is, is do you know anybody that would be interested in taking a look? Well, tell me what it's about. Maybe I would be. Well, it's about what you've already done all your life, Joan. You just hadn't been getting paid for it. I'll give you an example. Have you ever been to a movie or a restaurant that you like? You told somebody else about it, and they went to the movie or restaurant because you told them? All the time. All the time. Do you ever get paid for doing that, Joan? <laughs> no, of course not. No. Nobody does. Right. Well, how would you like to get paid for doing exactly that? Now, how could I do that? You can do it very well. I've been doing it for a long time. works very well. Listen, you have a pen and paper? I'm going to give you a free movie that tells you all about us, what we do, how we do it, and how you can get involved, and how you get paid. Okay. All right, write this down. It's okay. It's ttoradio.info. Okay. Okay, that's, that's, that's the free video online there. You watch that free video, and Joan, whenever you watch this video, you're going to love it. And whenever you love it, you're going to want to do what comes natural. You're going to want to share it with others. And when you do, guess what? Unlike in the past, now you get paid. How does that sound? Well, if it works, it sounds great. Good. It works great. I've been doing it for a long time. It works really well. Well, listen, watch that video, Joan, and whenever, you call, whenever you're done, call me back and let's talk about it. And whenever you call me back, because I've been in the industry for a while and I'm connected with people that have uh, very valuable training, I'm going to give you a free gift worth $1,000. Just for oh, calling wow. me back. Send okay. That business over right away. Okay. All right. Well, I'll see you when you call me back. Bye for now. Bye. Click. Okay. So I just got a yes to taking a look at my business opportunity, and you can get 15 to 25 yeses a day just like that. When they try to get me to explain the business, I do not tell them the name of the business. Well, if they say, what's the name of your company, I will tell them the name of the company, but then move right on in. So that's a training I do for free. I do it for anybody in the whole industry, and uh, I'll be starting those trainings up here in another couple of weeks once we get all launched here. Oh, one, cap one other thing, not a caveat, but in addition to that, this script is called the ultimate script and you can have it for free I can email it to you you can you can contact us at studio at TTO radio dot info and I will give you that script and uh, with that script you can internalize it and use it as a three-foot rule I learned the three-foot rule back 33 years ago it was tough and they, my upline had me going to shopping centers, going to grocery stores on purpose to go out and do nothing but collect names from the three-foot rule, and that was dysfunctional. So I don't do that today, but I am out in shopping malls. I am out in the public, and whenever I am in the public, I take me with me. And as because I take me with me, I'm not out there on purpose to network, but I am hypervigilant on purpose while I'm doing what I naturally do. That way I don't look out of place. And as I'm doing what I naturally do, I use my card along with that very script. And whenever people ask me, what is it that I do? I tell them, well, I do what you've already done all your life. You just hadn't been getting paid for it. And I use exactly the same script in face to face. So you can learn this script without even having the money to invest to get contacts or a system to manage it with. That's all I have for now. So does anybody have any comments or uh, uh, any follow-up comments on everything that's been talked about today? Uh, Alejandro, you haven't been able to uh, speak yet. Um, if you have any comments, uh, you're welcome to make them. Or if anybody has any comments or questions on from the panelists, um, ask them now, and then we'll close the show down. We're about 15 minutes after. Well, I think we just gave everybody a, a two to three hundred dollar uh, free video on how to make money on the internet. Um, this this um, this kind of information is usually sold in a package base, and and here we are spilling it out uh, all over the internet. Uh, can I speak now? Come uh, on, Alejandro. Okay. Uh, very very uh, educated. Uh, I have got. Lots as I, I agree with uh, with Carl. Today hangout has been very very illustrative. That's a university uh, course today. This hangout and uh, Janet, I got I got this. I'm gonna show it to you. Here's with red CLB. If 
I'm I'm very much convinced that I agree with you and that's the principle of everything if you do not have a list you do nothing that's that was I'm gonna be very brief I had a very nice conversation last night with a really really good friend that I uh, we became friends very good friends here in the internet uh, it's a guy that you all know and I've been working with him he, he's been a very nice very kind very helpful and we've sat down and talked each other and uh, we finally brought out of his avenue and my avenue and say hey come on we are a little bit depressed and guess what what is the depression that we have we find out and we see your posts on this so many people you have in your lists first car second Tracy third place would be Janet on the on the on the people that is coming into the each one each one of you on your nets on your groups and we just sat each other and we were facing this thing and we were telling each other well what are we going to do I feel very depressed because Carl has just posted that he's broke the 10,000 limit well resuming everything this the list that's the principle it, 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 it has worked for my particular business for so many years and I have to go into a CLB I will be with you 360 days a year Janet Leger before I I have to make a list that's it finish this has been very very illustrative for me and hope all people that are as new as I am in this matter will take it for serious you have to build a list with no contacts you do nothing here sir that's internet net means contacts that's it thank you very much for all appreciate all your comments because they are so helpful and I agree with you Carl this this hour and 18 minutes have been not even 300 500 or even a thousand dollars because let me tell you something I am used to pay for uh, education I've been in so many many courses and so many seminars all the world around in my profession and education costs and costs good education as the one you're given those give away from all of you for free is really precious thanks very much that's all, that's all for me Andrew thank you Alejandro really always appreciate your input uh, you have some great input from uh, from uh, Mexico there and uh, I'm grateful to have uh, I'm, we're all grateful to have somebody on our panel uh, who is from your area um, we'd like to see people available um, to bring content to this show from all areas if you'd like to be a panelist on our show uh, contact us at studio at ttoradio.info and let us know that you want to be a panelist that's studio at ttoradio.info we'll have a uh, contact form for that on the website uh, before too long listen does anybody else on the panel have any comments before I close us out yeah I do I just want to comment on on what Alejandro was saying you know um, this is a big step for a lot of people you know you we have a lot of people coming to the internet now 
Um, because, you know, the, the economies are, are kind of unstable all over the place. I know up here in Canada, uh, we're being shaken over by the, um, the oil industry, you know, uh, breaking out and stuff like that. So, um, you know, and in the States, you know, you guys, you guys down there are having an effect. And I know over in Europe, they're, they're being affected. I mean, the oil industry is, is affecting everything and all the economies. So it's driving people to the Internet now. Uh, people are looking to find a, a way to supplement their income uh, some way or another. And, you know, what we're trying to show you here today is the step-by-step -step form of how you can actually go out and create that extra 500000 2000 whatever it is you want a month. And <clears throat> we're doing this for free, folks, okay? We could easily um, charge a subscription to all of these kind of hangouts and stuff like that, but that's not what we're about. We're about trying to help people get out of their circumstance and into a position where they want to be. Nobody needs to be broke, no one needs to be struggling, and nobody needs to be stressed, period, okay? So when we provide this kind of information to you, take it to heart and use it, okay? It's your, this is your doorway to, to wherever you want to go. So that's my take on things, and thanks for listening to me today. Yeah, I have one last thing too, just before we wind up here, because I know we're coming to the bottom of the hour here as well. Carl, very well said. Everyone, you know, our panelists here, thank you so much for your input. Just want to reinforce that you get back to the person uh, that referred you. Uh, we're, we're sticklers here about ethics. This isn't about us, it's about you. Uh, this Everyone has the right to be have the right information. Everyone has the right to be educated and everyone has the right to be successful but it is definitely up to you to take those steps we've laid out so many gems of information here for you to just grab hold of something and hold on tight because I know that this what we have right now with Total Takeover really is a, a phenomenon and we want you to be part of it and um, I'm just checking the numbers here man we're like eight people away from tipping over that 20,000 mark congratulations to every one of you because it's your efforts that is driving this train and um, you know we're just very excited to be part of it and uh, we're here to work with you and work for you so uh, Andrew back over to you well said Tracy listen get back to the person that invited you to this radio show to this hangout to this YouTube video below this video or over there or up there or over there there's a button that you can subscribe to our channel with when you subscribe yep right there subscribe uh, if you're on ttoradio.info you have to scroll down the page and you'll see the subscribe button by subscribing to the channel you automatically get the invitation every day to say yes I'm gonna watch this show or and and promote it um, so get back to the person that invited you here and add as quickly as you can total takeover marketing success education and system to your portfolio of marketing no matter what your business is currently and always remember it takes leaders with vision to lead people with dreams let's participate in our own marketing ventures the way that we would want our personally sponsored to participate join us back here each day Monday through Friday 1 p.m. Eastern Standard Time be sure again get back with the person that invited you here and get their link to get your own TTO your total takeover system added to your own portfolio we'll see you back here Monday bye for now <laughs>